Here we are on this beautiful day on the roof of the uh, Cyber Experis building. My name is Jan Liedke, I'm SAP Chief Consultant at Cyber Norway and I'm going to show you a few new features of the release 1808. So follow me. SAP Business by Design release 1808, that is August 2018 release, has provided some improvements to the Work Center overview pages. Those overview pages are the what I call quick glance pages and they show at a glance some statistics, figures, graphs, tasks, reports, results and more. Before those overview features were visible on the home center or home work center only uh, but now they appear on each and every work center. You can see it here, here and so on. So here I'm logged in as a finance manager, David Nash, and uh, the work centers on the left hand side provide me with the access based on the roles that were assigned to my user ID, giving me exactly the right functionality um, to uh, my work related transactions and monitor for monitoring and execution. As a finance manager, I want to have lo a look into financial aspects of accounts payable that we have here. So it contains my suppliers, automatic payments, clearing, periodic task and reports. When I navigate to the overview screen, then the screen unfolds with uh, my work items. Uh, supplier information, automatic payments and clearing, statistics concerning the cash discounts, an aging list, small kind of uh, report and uh, mass changes. So everything is neatly organized and accessible and if I want to check a blocked supplier um, all it takes to click on the link as I do here. Going back to uh, payables uh, those cards um, um, basically are a little or small brief version of uh, reports. They run as soon as the overview screen is started and if I want to refresh the view, meaning to run the report again, I can click on the blue refresh, refresh link uh, that is behind this tiny time information. As you can see here, the clearing, this was 35 uh, seconds ago run. I want to uh, update it and it's updated now. Now this looks all very nice and standard but there are a few things I want to change in order to get the information that is most important for me. For example my report here is really crammed in and I have to scroll uh, left and right. I want to change this. So since release 1808 um, we can use the same personalization concepts for example picking a card from a gallery and changing the card settings. This I will demonstrate in part two. Part two. I hope you liked this video and uh, see you soon.